Hey YouTubers, J and B here from JB Coins. We have uh, an interesting video here for you, hopefully. We have a combination of coin show finds that we want to show you and share with you, along with some quick tips about how to go through a coin show and get the best deal. We also have a package that we received from Tony Z, and we'll talk about that at the end of talking about these items. So the first thing is you can see we've got a bunch of uncirculated mint sets, 2002, 2003, and 2005, and they come as a set P and D back then. They're, they're a red one and a blue one. Now they've changed over the years, so some of them are in one case, one package, the newer ones. The older ones are in paper uh, envelopes. And you should have a red and a blue, which stands for Denver and Philadelphia. And these are the uncirculated, not proof sets or mint sets. So if you're looking for a coin in higher grade or a rare coin with a specific date mint mark, these are what you're looking for to get a P&D. Okay. So Sweetie was going through the show. She found these dates, which we've done videos on all of these. So if you want to know what we're looking for in here, you can go to the video for 2002s, 2003s, or 2005s in our playlist about statehood quarters. And these are the only ones that she found that were in good condition. And that's one of the first keys we want to touch base with you on a tip. Instead of buying from eBay, where they may have a stock photo or the photo may not quite show the flaws on the coins, go to a coin show or go to a coin shop. Sometimes you'll even find these in the discount bins in coin shops. Um, know what you want to go looking for in the first place. Then go through all of the sets that they have in this given year, for example, and find the best looking set of coins and buy that set because you don't know if a set is going to be milky or spotted or carbon spotted or anything like that. Or you could be doing like B was. She was looking for one specific coin out of each of these years. But in order to get that, she had to buy the entire set for this year, this year, and this year. So she was just checking the condition of that one coin in each set that she knew she was looking for. And she was willing to pay the price to get P&D in order to get that one coin in the condition she wanted. It's actually cheaper quite often to do that than to go and buy an individual coin that's been graded or slabbed or is for sale in the shop or the show or on eBay. So that's the first tip. The second tip is being doing this in person as opposed to eBay. Once you lay out on the table all the things you want to buy from that dealer, then you can start to negotiate price because their prices are usually not firm. Some dealers will not budge and we usually walk away from them. Um, <laughs> we've run across quite a few of them that they're not friendly. They don't even get up from their seat when you come to their booth. They're grumpy. You ask them a question. They're grouchy with the answer and they don't budge on the price. And we just move along because you're in a show with 20, 50, 100, 200 different booths. Why deal with somebody like that, right? So B was able to find, as I said, 2002 P&D, 2003 P&D, and 2005 P&D unk sets for one coin for each year. And she was looking for 10 more. And they had the sets of those years at the show, but the coins were in crappy condition in plain English. So she didn't get them. So that's what that's part of it too, is you have to, we all talk about how this is addicting and you and you can't walk past change and you, you know. It's all part of this. If you really get into coins and love coins and really learn about coins, not just watch a coin show or a video, but actually learn about them. OK, it's one thing to be hanging out at a, in a coin show or in a, in a coin chat. And it's another thing to be a numismatist or a coin collector. So one of the things is, is you have to remember, this is like buying a car or buying a house. There's nothing really different. Everything is negotiable. And you have to be, just like in any of those purchases, you have to be willing to walk away from the dealer that has that coin you've been looking for forever, but his price is off the chart. You walk away because you're going to find one one day 
that's in the condition you want for the price you want. You're just not going to get it right now. But why pay two times, you know, even one and a half times what a coin should be worth when you don't have to? So this is almost all of what we found in the coin show. Um, we actually started using some of the coins in our last live stream, but you see I'm wearing the white gloves, which I almost never do. Um, so these are some of the scores. And you can tell I'm kind of excited because we, we really kicked butt. B did an awesome job as usual. We have a whole tube of copper rounds. There's two of each design because one for us, one for giveaways. So that's, you know, that's why the, it's down from the top. Um, but you can see these are all brand new, no fingerprints. So we have those copper rounds. We have, we really scored with a couple of the dealers. This show was really unusual. It's the first time we ever went to this show. And there's a lot of shows in our area. Uh, you know, just huge amount of coin shops, huge amount of coin shows. And we're always looking for the best coins we can find. We're always looking for, B, for BU coins, like you see on these tubes, okay? All these tubes are BU tubes. And those are from the dealer. You can see they're two different handwritings, they're two different inks. And we have not seen a show in a long time where they had this many uh, 40 percenters, 90 percenters especially, hard to find dates like 65s. Um, and check this out, a whole tube of 68D, MS 63 to 65, And that's a little piece of foam to protect it. An entire tube like that. And we got them after we laid all our coins. He gave us an initial price. And once we laid out all of the things we were buying from him, we asked again, what was he willing to do on price? And he actually knocked off a few bucks off of our total bill. And that's what you want to do. You don't want to negotiate when you got two coins on the table. You want to negotiate lower prices uh, because not all dealers are going to come down and not all dealers are going to give you BU coins like this even though silver prices are down. Some of them are still holding on to old inventory they got to sell. They want the higher price and there's a lot of consumers at the shows that will buy them. We have to buy them anyway because we need them for the live streams. But price is still something that we're conscious of. But it was just amazing because we got BU 65s this is what's left in here. We gave away many of these yesterday in the live stream. So we've seen these. So check out this tube of Benji's. And again, we gave away some of these. So they're mixed dates, but they're all BU. And this one, 1966 BU. Aren't they beautiful? And then how about this? The dealer let me actually open the roll so that I could see all the coins. 67 BU, all the way through the tube, all the way through the roll. No crimper marks either. <laughs> so now what we'll do after we've shot this video is we will put all these in two by two slabs, except for the coppers. Um, we'll put them in a, um, we'll put them in something, I'm not sure, but, but all these coins will go in two by two slabs like this and we will mark them with what they are. And these are for our, uh, roll pull from the pull bag, or you can get them from the marked rolls themselves because we mark five rolls in every box that we do. And a Benji, a Walker, 40 percenters just from those five rolls per box. Uh, or five mark rolls. Um, so the other thing we scored, which was amazing, was a 1943 Mercury, and you can see uncirculated, beautiful condition. 1942 AU to Unc.
and a 1936 Philadelphia Unk. And you can see these are two different dealers, but um, or two different people's handwriting. They were at the same same booth. So these will these will go as free giveaways uh, in our live streams. I've already explained where these go, but here you can see really good examples of why we go to the extra trouble and we say we don't give no junk. So these will get nice clean new slabs. All of these will get slabs and that's how we give them away so enough about that that's all this that's the stuff we found at the coin show for the family that we wanted to talk to you about the next thing is we got a package from tony z tony z was searching through a box of halves and she got skunked looking for silver uh nifsies and things like that she even wrote on here i got skunked but she found a ton of bicentennials and so she sent this bag to us with with all these bicentennials to give away so you'll start seeing these in our live streams uh, in the giveaways uh, she had a great note with it the package was was kind of messed up so so we wanted to talk to her and then and then show this to you folks um, so we have that so thank you so much tony because we know there's a lot of folks that like bicentennials <laughs> So, um, so yeah, we'll, we'll give those away. So this is the video that you will leave a comment for tonight's live stream, Saturday, February the 29th, leap year. Starts at 6 p.m. Central, 7 p.m. Eastern. We'll have four boxes. So you can start securing roles for tonight's live stream uh, at PayPal, jbcoinsinc at gmail.com. And it's a five roll minimum. You get three pulls for that, which you could get some of this stuff. And there's no max limit. You can go all the way up to a full box if you want. So hope to see you all there in the comment down below. This is the entry video after all for tonight's giveaways to be qualified. So in the comment section below, tell us out of all of this stuff, or all of what we talked about, what you liked the most. And if you do that, it'll be a qualified entry and you'll be able to have one minute on the timer. You have to be present in the live stream when we call your name out and shout out that you're here before that sand runs out and then you get your, you get your, your uh, prize. It's as simple as that. And we have a lot of fun. We got a great group of folks and more info below below this screen so thank you all for watching hope you enjoyed it see you tonight at the live stream